and you should just say stop anywhere you want. Stop. All right, we're gonna use two cards. Doesn't matter what they are, take a look at them. You can show the camera, is not that kind of a trick. Okay, so we have the five of clubs and we have the six of hearts. So this is what we're gonna do. They're not gonna be facing the same way. They're gonna be facing um, opposite of each other, as you see. That way, when you sign one, then you'll sign the other and we'll sign the back. And for that, we need the Sharpie. So, can you go ahead and sign that five? This one? Yep. Yeah. Perfect, and then sign the back of the six. Oh, look at that, you've done this before. <laughs> and then, can you sign the front of the six now, and then the back of the five? Okay. Now, in order for us to, technically, you have signed both sides of those cards. Um, and this is what we're going to do. We're going to have them go into the fourth dimension. And in order to do that, we're just going to do this very important cut right about there, then here. But the most important of them all is actually right through the center. It is because this one that we can start changing the way this reality works, or at least for those cards. And as you can see now, they're technically in the fourth dimension right now. Dang. Now. It is here that I can change the properties of how these cards are actually put together. And you'll notice that if I actually take this and look, if we go like this, you'll notice that it almost looks like they're going through <laughs> each other. Yeah. And it is when you come back that you have something that's quite irregular because <laughs> you have <laughs> there is your five with the six Dang. and here is the back with your signatures and you can check everything out. That's good.